Hey everybody, it's Jim and welcome back to another lesson introduction to Corn Shell. Now last time we went over default values for a variable and we're going to do another example today. So we have our program which is called default values 2.ksh and optionally it will take a value. That's what those square braces mean, optionally. So we are going to go over default values if no values were entered on the command line. Once again, we have our default age, freshman age of 18. We're still trying to get Henry's age in this example. We print a blank line and we print what the value of the variable Henry is at this point. And as you may have noticed, the only thing we've done to this point is to find a variable called freshman age. So the variable Henry doesn't even exist at this point, so it's not going to have a value. So before magic, Henry should have nothing in between these two colons. Next, I just put this here to show you the example from the last script. It was the variable Henry will be equal to the result of this. We have our dollar sign curly brace, curly brace. We have one variable. We have another variable. And in the middle we have the colon dash. And the colon dash says if this has a value, assign the value within this to this variable. If it doesn't, assign the value of this to this variable. So in our current example, we replace Henry with the number 1. In other words, dollar sign $1, which would be the first parameter you would enter. Going back up to the top, right here, the dollar sign $1 is this optional value you can enter. So, if person enters a value, then that gets assigned to Henry. The person doesn't enter a value, then freshman age gets assigned to Henry, and we just print the value of the variable Henry afterwards. Let's run this. Okay, the first time we run this, we will not enter in a value. So it should pick up the default, which is 18. So before the magic, Henry, the variable Henry, doesn't exist. So therefore, it has no value. And after we do our assignment to the variable Henry, the variable Henry has value of 18. Now let's assign an age of 53. So as you can see, it did pick up the value from here. So the other way to use this default parameter stuff is to use command line arguments. 